Hey everybody, thanks for joining. Today we're going to take a look at a great web development tool called CodePen. As you can see in my web browser, I already am at the CodePen site. Uh, it's codepen.io. It's not codepen.com. Type in codepen.io and your browser will take you here. And they say CodePen is a playground for the front end web. It's really easy to get started. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is sign up for a new account. So that's pretty easy. You go to the sign up button. And the first thing that might scare you off is you see all these plans that cost money. Well, if you scroll down, you'll see that there are free plans in the lower left hand corner. So you can just click this button in the lower left hand corner. And there's not going to ask me too many questions here. It's going to say uh, we need a name and a username. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and put in my name, Chris. And the username will be the title of the blog, Just Get Coding. And uh, we do have an email address at Just Get Coding. It is justgetcoding at gmail.com. And, um, you know, let's, let's put in a, a password that, that we can use to log into CodePen. Now, when you're choosing an email address for this, make sure this is an email address you're going to be able to get email at. You will need to go to that email address to confirm your account, verify that I'm not a robot, and then click sign up. Now, after you've signed up, they, uh, they have quite a bit of, of other options that I could use here. I don't really need any of this stuff. So if I just click on the logo in the upper left hand corner, I will be back at CodePen and ready to start. Uh, they show you some, some other web uh, experiments that other people have done. And CodePen calls these pens. Every web experiment is called a pen. So now that I'm logged in, you can see that uh, they know who I am with my default image here. You can change that later if you like. All you have to do is click New Pen and you will get a view that looks just like this. Now we'll get started in the next video with how to turn this into a learning environment for your first web page. Uh, let me show you what it looks like when you receive the email and you can see that I got a couple emails from CodePen. One of them welcomes me and then importantly is this one that says verify your email and if I click on it they, they just want to make sure that they've actually reached your email address, so it's a good, a good sign that I got this email. I'll click to verify it, and CodePen's gonna tell me that I'm all ready to go. It just, it just brings me to the website. So in the next video, we'll start uh, working on our first web page. Thanks for listening, and if you like what you see here, don't forget to like and subscribe to these videos.